No, I have to go back to see my boys. He's gonna disappear as he's running away. Oh no! Oh no! What is happening? And just like that, season two of Loki has come to an end. And I feel like this show has been coming out for weeks, but it's already finished. It's already over. But today I'm going to be reacting to episode five and six. And episode five is called Science Fiction. And with how episode four finished, with literally everyone dying, everyone at the TVA is dead. I wonder how episode five is going to go and just how they're going to wrap up the whole show in general. So let's just get on with episode five. Jet skis, sea dews, one of these calling your name, Mobius? I don't know about calling. Maybe gently whisper. I feel like I've said this every video I've made on Loki. If we don't see Mobius on a jet ski, why do you keep making jokes about it? <laughs> His whole thing is jet skis. Put him on one. Is he the only one that lived? He got to survive it because, well, we know Loki never dies. <laughs> Never back down, never what? Never give up! No way, was he actually the only one that survived? Back to the time slipping. This is not happening! <laughs> well, could he time slip to a time before it exploded then? Hello? Was that him? We are stuck in a time loop. Hello? But which one is our present one? No idea what's going on, but it looks really cool. You know, the graphics are really cool. Thank you for your service, that sounds so ominous. Why is Casey in prison? Hurry up! If they catch us, they're gonna cut us like fish! They're gonna cast like a fish. <laughs> he knows. <laughs> you gotta find your own way off this rock. Sorry, pal. What he did? <laughs> Bet you wish you went thin now. <laughs> he was like copying the the floaty thing. I really like his really good visuals of him and how it like transitions to each different place. Does it still hurt? That's good. But do you remember how bad it hurt when you came in? That's good too. Oh my god. She was a doctor before she went to the TVA. She went from like saving people's lives to pruning the timelines and killing people. When she finds out, when she finds out what she was before she went to the TVA, oh my god, that's gonna crush her. Do you see what I see? And nothing but open water in front of you. Don, Woo. your son's calling on line three. Tell him I'll call him back. <gasps> oh my god, he had a child. Come on, you ready for your Poseidon moment? Jump up on this bad boy. Hey, so jet skis. Oh, but he had a son. He had a son. Oh my god, wait. It was in the last episode where Sylvia's like... Where's it Sylvia? Yeah, Sylvia was like, you know you're a variant, like, you know you had a life before the TVA and you're too scared to go back or whatever. Why does he actually does know about his life before the TVA and he knew he had a son and he just didn't want to face that and he just wanted to completely forget about it. He's one of the greats. I read everything he does. OB! Yeah, but I have to ring it up or... It's him. Are you buying your own book? I told you to stop putting your sci-fi books on our shelves. <gasps> well, nobody buys it here. He's pretty sad. <laughs> He's a writer, though. That's pretty cool. Also pretty sad that no one's buying his books. But the way he tries to stock them <laughs> himself and then buy it. <laughs> My most popular book of all time. I'm sure I can find your copy somewhere around here. <laughs> Wait. You were a writer. Science fiction. I'm doomed. I had to get a PhD to get my day job teaching theoretical physics at Caltech. Wait, you're a scientist as well? That's great. Yeah, <laughs> until I can quit and write full. The way you turned him down when you found that he was a writer. <laughs> you need to learn how to control your time slipping. With science, it's all what and how. But with fiction, 
It's why. Because if I can't save the TVA from being destroyed, there will be nothing to protect against what's coming. Anything? Um, I'm trying. Obi was the perfect person to come to because of the science fiction aspect. I would have to invent it all from scratch. It could take a whole lifetime. We don't need a lifetime when we've got the user manual. There's one on every desk at the TVA. So I am going to write a bestseller. <laughs> yeah, sort of. That's cute. <laughs> a beautiful union of form and function. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you've already sold him the pitch many times before. <laughs> Mobius is your real name, and you belong in a place called the TVA. Is that right? We don't belong there because he was taken. He belongs here, and wherever his name is here is his name. How did you build a temp pad so fast? I had to take a break and move out when I lost my job and my wife left me. <laughs> Oh good, yeah, I was gonna say, because he's from a different time, he's gonna keep... That's how they get everyone, oh, it all makes sense. Reality isn't what you think it is, and this isn't the life of the man I know. I don't know who you know. But now you're just kind of taking him away from his kids and his life here. Are you really my friend? I am. Um, who's he? Is he my friend? Oh, my boys. They'll be fine. Will they? What happens to them? Look, you can come back anytime. You were, uh, you were at the shop earlier, right? Oh my god, well, I don't get it. I don't get it. How is there multiple versions? All of existence is in grave danger. I don't care. And your boys are in danger too. That's true, if you just put like another variant there but this one knows this one knows he knows about his life here he knows about his children is this everyone there's one more the dreaded one his lover from another mother this is gonna sound strange i know you don't know who Becky, i am of course i know who you are what what i was gonna say because she always knew she was a variant will she still know if they had a choice would have chosen to stay Mobius always said the TVA was the only life he'd ever known, and he liked it. Because it was. That's the truth to him. Until now, he knows that he has, like, different lives. I guess this all worked out just the way you wanted it to, and you're fine just walking away. So selfish. Of course I'm selfish. I want a life. I want to live. What's wrong with wanting something like this? Exactly. Sylvie finally got everything she's always wanted. Her life back, or a life back. And the TVA gone, so... I want to save the TVA. Why? I want the TVA back. And? I want my friends back. I don't want to be alone. See? Oh, Loki. I know this is hard. But your friends are back where they belong. This scene is making me feel like the final episode is going to be sad or something. <laughs> I feel like Loki's going to lose or lose someone. We're all writing our own stories now. Go write yours. And this is what it's well, she has to do it because her timeline is disappearing. No, but so seriously, if they don't restore the TVA, does that mean every single timeline is going to disappear? Or just every branched timeline? Like, will one, the sacred timeline, will that remain? Yes, so it'll be nice with the dangers, hun. Come hip hop, skedaddle to Loki. Does that mean that timeline is completely gone or just the shop? <laughs> like, was that supposed to represent the whole timeline disappearing? Everything's falling apart. The branches are dying. I don't know what's happening, but there must be something we can do. Mm -hmm. What do we do? What do we 
is going on? They're disappearing again. It was a fiction problem. Ah, the why? Why is it happening? <laughs> no, I have to go back to see my boys. But... He's gonna disappear as he's running away. Oh no! Oh no! What is happening? Does that mean their timelines are disappearing? Who's next? Are we gonna lose Sylvie? There's nowhere left to go. But she knows everything. Why is she leaving as well? <laughs> Why not Loki though? Why not Loki? I have to go back to see my boys. It's because he's a man out of time. He's a man without time. What? You're not, you're not Steve Rogers. You're not Captain America. What is happening? Do you think that what makes a Loki a Loki is the fact that we're destined to lose? <laughs> Still there. There's nowhere left to go. He's putting it back. It's him. He's gonna reverse time. He's the he's the rewind button. No, they aren't. Everything's falling <gasps> apart. Because he can fuck he can it's because, it's because it's it's a fiction problem. He can finally control his time slipping. I controlled it. You learn to control your time slipping. But it's not just it's not his time slipping, it's just all of time because he was bringing it all back, not just fixing him to a point. It's not about where, when, or why. It's about who. Who? <laughs> I don't like you were staring at the camera then. <laughs> I gotta fix time for you, you audience. I can rewrite the story. Because it's time to rewrite his story, bitch. Oh, this actually pisses me off. <laughs> well, they always leave it on a cliffhanger. And I'm actually filming this a couple of days before the final episode. So now I have to wait on the cliffhanger. So it's going to be an end credit scene. Because we didn't see... Yeah, those are the guys in the TBA little bubble, you know, that's Loki and his friends. But we didn't see what happened to Victor or Ravona or Miss Minutes. I wanna see Ravona. <laughs> I wanna see Ravona again. It's time for the final episode. And it's called Glorious Purpose, so I'm assuming this show's gonna end how we started <laughs> with episode one of season one, because that's also called Glorious Purpose. Oh my gosh. We're getting like a reverse. We get the logo into this part instead of this into the logo. Oh, it's because we're it's because we're reversing time, isn't it? <laughs> Back. You okay? Yes, yes. We have to get Tiny out there. It's because it can't be Victor. It has to be Loki that does it. Here we go. Is Loki gonna like time slip down there? Because let's go, let's go. He hasn't gone down yet. Like, why is he waiting? <laughs> What could we have done differently? Good question. We took too long. <sighs> it's just gonna keep redoing it over and over again until it's done right. Load the multiplier, hit the green button, launch it and get back, okay? Okay. That's exactly right. Let's keep moving. Let's go faster this time. Or why don't you come back before this? But like before the explanation, like... Like just like way back. Let's keep moving. Let's go to the faster this time. This time? Why don't Loki just do it? Loki, you know how to do it. Not faster. Is it over? Earlier. There you go, see, earlier. Wait, miss minutes. I know right now you're hurt and you're angry, but we need your help in finishing the three. And you're love stricken. <laughs> I wasted time and now does time waste me? Let's hit the multiple. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Again. Why don't you go before a time where. Like before it started becoming a problem? Or like before it started becoming a really big problem? What, why me? Because you volunteered. You did. You will. Something could go wrong. Mobius, you're in luck. It looks like Mobius, but it's actually Victor Timely. That's, that's Victor. Me. <laughs> everybody following? Yes. yes. Good. Victor. Obi, how long will it take me to know everything that you know about mechanics, physics, and engineering? <laughs> how much do you know? Let's assume Nothing. I don't know much. But I'm a fast learner, and I'm a god. Well. So he's going to teach him everything and then he's going to rewind time and he's 
gonna do it himself. Decades. S centuries. It's okay. We've got time. Here's the plan. Get in, get suited up, load the multiplier, hit the green button, launch it, and get back. Got it. By the way, remember. Is it gonna work though? You know, after all this, is it gonna work? Or is it just, you know, it's an infinite point in time where it just has to happen? Nothing can change it. Better watch out, OB. Looks like someone... someone's coming for your job. That's right. I'm a coming, I'm a coming. OB, watch your back. Casey! <laughs> oh, this is funny. What the shit are you doing? Trust me. <laughs> no. I know what I'm doing. You're ruining Mobius's jokes. <laughs> this all seems a bit rushed. Only to you. <laughs> Needs to be. <laughs> Oh, this is the moment. They're in a lineup formation. This is the moment. I mean, it's like a thick, false pressure to walk through. That's it. One step at a time. Be brave. You're being so brave. <laughs> Can I have that as like a wake up call or something? <laughs> Be brave. You're so brave. <laughs> Hit the button. It can be a little sticky. <laughs> he did it. Not working. Yes! Oh, it did work. Oh, I thought you just like just shot something off, but I thought you might have to like keep blasting it. It's gonna work this time. He's not gonna make it back though. Come back. So like, does Loki go back and do it all again just to save him, or you know, just <laughs> let this be the time it works? You did it. We're gonna make it. Finally. It's integrating. It's all too happy. <laughs> it's too happy. <laughs> How can the readings be off? How can the loom is overloading again? It did increase the throughput, but there's well, just there's too, too many. many branches. We have to get out of here. So <laughs> gonna work hard. <laughs> can't run away. <laughs> you can't escape time. As soon as the timeline started branching, this was doomed to happen. Oh no. He's gonna go back and stop her from killing him. Stop. Stop. But then she doesn't get what she wants. Stop. None of them know, none of the TVA variants know they have a family. Oh no, they do know, but they don't go back. You've been seduced by a throne. The last thing I want is a throne. Sylvie, stop. If you want me to stop, you have to kill You'll me. You have to kill me. <laughs> Oh my god, and he will. He'll do it. Close. Save everyone who have to sacrifice the one. That was cool. Stopping it and all that with the magic. If you want to stop me, you'll have to kill me. Loki, you just have to do it. You want to stop me, you'll have, have to kill you. I get it. You just have to kill her. This is a lot for you. <laughs> I get it. So why don't you just go through this a couple thousand more times get your bearings he learned to pause time this is the first time we've had this conversation i was kind of hot <laughs> see he knows the temporal loom is a failsafe deletes the ones that aren't supposed to be there. Everything except the sacred timeline. I'll change the equation. I'll break your loom. Break the loom and you cause a war that kills us all. Game over. Kill her. And we protect what we can. It's a tough choice. Can't you just grab her, like lock her up and be like, it's for your own good. No, no, but king of what exactly? He's gonna go back before he ever met Sylvie. Most purpose is more burden than glory. You never want to be the guy who avoids it because you can't live with the burden. Yeah, he's burdened with glorious purpose. How do you live with that scar tissue? No, there's no comfort. You just choose your burden. <sighs> he's gonna go kill Sylvie. <laughs> Oh, I'm getting a little emotional because I don't know what's coming. It was designed to protect the sacred timeline and nothing else. Oh, of course it is. So you have to kill me. 
No, just try persuasion. <laughs> really good persuasion. Do you really want to be the god who takes away everyone's free will so you can protect that? But what good is free will if everyone's dead? That's true. <laughs> That's true. You're replacing one nightmare with another. Yeah, and I get that, but like, he has tried so hard to try and save it different ways. If there's a hope that you can replace that thing. <sighs> yeah, why don't we time slip to the beginning of time from when He Who Remains first made the loom and made, and made something different. Okay. What are you doing? Oh my god, he's not even gonna put the suit on? I know what I want. But I can't have it. I know what kind of god I need to be. Self-sacrificing god. Oh, I really thought it was... Oh no, it is doing it! I was gonna say, I really thought he's like, clothes, his suit was gonna like, strip away into like... Like his suit, like he's royal. This is his final form. Because he's got, you know, like, fully form, fully formed horns. Is he using his magic to re- to- to what? <laughs> oh, he just blew it up. That was some really good sound design. Don't quite understand what's happened though. He blew up the loom and he's just letting the- he's just letting the timelines, you know, just go free. The branches are dying. What? But he's like putting life back into him. I really like the sound design because like it actually sounds like branches. <laughs> like when they blow in the wind. It kind of looks like Strange Things. Like Strange Things what season two? Where they're trying to close the wall between the upside down. <laughs> He just took, he just took the timelines. He just took them. <laughs> he just walked out. <laughs> so he's just taking the timelines to he who remains. Have at him. Or is he becoming it? He's becoming the timekeeper. He's gonna sit on the throne and he's gonna be like, trapped there, you know, like he has to stay he has to stay looking after the timelines oh my god he made himself the temporal loom he made his own version so all that goes through him through his magic just out in space and time. It looks like a tree. Oh, I was gonna say, don't end the episode there. I need some explanation. Oh, and it is like a tree. I love it. Let it grow. Hey, y'all. I miss me. And are we sure she won't try to kill us all? <laughs> yeah. Mm. We'll never know. We'll never know of her. We'll never know. No, is Mobius looking at a picture of his kids? Or of Loki? Is that his one? Funny you should mention that, because... He's leaving. Mobius leaving. is leaving. Oh, oh! You think the TVA is gonna miss a tired, washed-up old analyst with a heart of gold? I think there is one or two who will. I think I will miss you. Gotta go see what exactly it is we've been protecting for all this time. They need you in there. Yeah, she become like the new leader, like the new head, the new judge. It's a new handbook. Ah, oh, and it's in the second edition. Is it going to be written by Loki? <laughs> like, did he co-write it? I thought Obi was like gonna go back and give him a second edition. Or is this them showing that they're not messing with him? You know, they're not, because they're trying to take down all of the Kang variants. 
and that's their new mission at the TVA is not to prune t uh, branch timelines but it's to make sure none of Kang's rise up. <laughs> I like how they've shown us Ravona, but is she just lost to the void? Is she gonna get eaten by a liar? Not her seeing like everything she's trying to protect just come just getting broken down in front of her. The inmates are running the asylum! Okay, okay, peace. Come on, I don't get Luke's. How does he then just just go into that line? I might just wait here for a little bit. Wait, so he can't step into that. He can't. Let time pass. He can't then go like join his family. Well, now you're seeing what you can't. Like you now you're seeing what you want, but you can't have. Does that not hurt more than never knowing? Never. Never seeing what you know. Are we gonna get a look at Loki on his throne? It's quite sad. <laughs> like, yeah, he's protecting everyone, he's saving everyone. He saved his friends, you know, but he can't, can't be with his friends. Are we gonna get a post credit scene teaser of <laughs> Loki season three? <laughs> I'm actually glad there wasn't an end credit scene teasing the season three because I don't want there to be one. This show ended really well for all of the characters and for the story, the Loki story as a whole. I think it was really nice how everyone got what they wanted. Yes, Loki has to like control the timelines himself and he can't, you know, just go out and be with his, be with his friends, but he saved everyone and everyone, including Sylvie, now can go to their life on the timeline, they can have free will, they can, they can have what they want. Did I want Ravona to somehow make it out of the void and turn to the good side again? Yes. Was her ending deserved and she got what, you know, she got what she deserved? Yes. <laughs> I just somehow want to get Owen Wilson. I somehow want to get Owen Wilson in, in more Marvel things. Him as Mobius in more things. I somehow make it work Marvel, I want to see that. And Obi. <laughs> I have no idea how you're going to get either of these characters in a future Marvel project, but make it happen. <laughs> Give us like a special presentation of Obi and Mobius just going out, like Obi's teaching him science, Mobius is teaching him how to ride a jet ski. <laughs> I don't know, make it work. But I really enjoyed this season and these final two episodes. What did you think about Loki season two and the series finale? Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, please leave a like and subscribe for more for future Marvel content. But thanks for watching. Bye.